I'm an apple farmer, apple and pear farmer. Right here is an apple that's straight off of the tree from our farm. This is also an apple from our farm, but it's been through the cleaning process. I'm gonna take off the sticker. If I take my sharp pointy thing and I scrape the skin, you'll see that a bunch of wax comes off. That might shock you guys that there is wax on store-bought apples, but let me show you the thing with this apple is straight off the tree. It's got clay on it. That's that dusty looking stuff. That's for sunburn protection. If I polish it up, it looks just like this other apple. If I scrape the skin on this one straight off the tree, you'll see there's wax on it as well. They have what is called a cuticle on them. The apple produces a natural wax on it and this helps with water retention so it doesn't get all wrinkly and stuff. It also looks very attractive to any like species that might want to eat it. And it's super important for the overall like health of the apple. When we take it off the tree, we send it into our warehouse and they clean it because it needs to be cleaned before it goes to you guys. Some of that natural wax is actually stripped from it. And so we have to replace it with a natural like food grade wax. Now this would be um, carnauba base and then also like beeswax natural food grade wax, pretty much the same thing as the natural wax that the apple produces itself. There's so much fear mongering around food and like where our food comes from. And I don't want you guys to be scared of what you're putting in your bodies, especially when it's something that is such a superfood like apples are. Do what you want with that information. Merry Christmas.